Well, likewise, it's, it's great. What an amazing place to play music. Mm. It's so beautiful. Thank yeah. you for having us. It's been a lovely, it's been a lovely celebration. Mm -hmm. a great year. Yeah. 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 It's an album that means, well, it means a lot to us. So, as you say, it, it sort of pushed us from being nobodies to sort of changing our lives and getting to, to do this. Um, but, but also, I think, you know, the album made a huge impact on lots of people around the world and I don't think we really ever expected or imagined that was going to happen. Um, so it really took us by surprise. And what's lovely is that it still seems to have that effect on people. So there's, it's not just, when you look out to a keen audience now, it's not just the old fans from 20 years ago. It's like people that we seem to have collected along the way, people who weren't even born yeah, 20 people, years ago. <laughs> yeah, it's great. Yeah. We're, we're very proud of the record and yeah, you, like Tom says, you can't imagine that it's going to last like that and mean that much to people. So yeah, we've been that, very lucky, yeah. but I think the songs mean a lot to us and that's a pretty good starting place. Yeah. I think it was, I, I don't know what I was going to say, but I think we almost feel more proud, well I feel certainly, more proud now about it than maybe I did back then, or at least you know, celebrating this 20 years has actually given us a chance to enjoy the impact of the record in a way that we didn't at the time. Like when it came out, it was all, everything happened so fast and we were younger. I don't think we, and we, and I think you kind of think, oh, it's always going to keep going at this sort of trajectory, you know, but it doesn't, you know, you have to, we were too young to recognise how special and important that was, was for us. So. Now being able to do it again is... It's, when you look out into the crowd and you see what the songs mean to people, it's, it's very special and they still mean so much to people. And they still feel, some of them, we haven't played some of them that much over the years. So going back to the album has been a chance to sort of look at some of them with sort of fresh eyes and ears and, um, mm. and that's been really fun. You look out in the crowd and you see people crying, you see people laughing, smiling, <laughs> hugging, you know, just yeah. lost in, you know, with their eyes closed, you know, who knows, you know, who they're thinking about, what they're thinking about, what mm. time of their life. And it, yeah, music does, but yeah, everyone's sort of singing together. So it's got a sort of, you know, a unifying power as well, yeah. doesn't it? Very much so. It's been great. Yeah. It feels really celebratory, really positive. Yeah, and I think we're, we're in a very good space as a band as well. We feel very together, I think we've, so a lot of Are you, kind can of, you hear that? Sorry. We've sort of done a lot of yeah, work, you know, on ourselves and on the relationships we have in the band. It's very easy, I think, for bands to drift apart. Yeah. And I think actually this, the really lovely thing about Keen is that we've feels like we've got closer, more of a tight knit unit than we ever ha than we ever have been probably. And I think that feels really special. So um, I can't even remember what the... Yeah, it's been was, really fun yeah. touring, you know, it's just yeah. been, yeah, I think the most enjoyable touring we've done. Ever. You know, ever. In my opinion. Which is, yeah. yeah. Which is, you know, again, it's a, you, you can't sort of anticipate it, but it's just been really fun just hanging out, the four of us, you know, we, more often than not, we have, you know, breakfast together or dinner together or, you know, and just hang out a lot and enjoy each other's company and that's, you know, it's, it's not always the case with bands. You sometimes see other bands come in and you sort of think, you guys only ever see each other on stage or something, you know? <laughs> so yeah, yeah, it's yeah. been lovely. Yeah, yeah it's got a kind of glitzy yeah, it's very feel glamorous. to it. Yeah, very glamorous. You said that you'd, you'd driven up this evening because you'd been out off site and you came back and everyone's, you know, dressed up, looking beautiful and, you know, just yeah. sort of, and, and really looking forward to a proper night out. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. And I, yeah, and I think it's really nice for us because coming from the UK, you can't do shows outdoors in the evening. It's not, it's too, it's, you know, it's, the weather's too unpredictable. So, and these kind of warm evenings, it feels like life really starts up at about this time of night, you know, eight, nine o'clock in Spain. Hmm. And um, so we're really vibing off that. It's so nice, it's, yeah just driving up to the gig this evening and seeing everyone just kind of hanging out, looking glamorous, ready for a great night. It's really cool. Just, yeah. yeah, it's very, it's the opposite of what you might get in the UK. This About this time of night, everyone's kind of 
yeah. miserable and tucked up in bed. Exactly. <laughs> This yeah. kind of show we want the audience to take part in, so we try and play quite a lot of songs that they're going to know. Um, but, you know, yeah, so it's, it's not a passive show. They have to take part. You know, they need to sing along, they need to dance, they need to clap, yeah. laugh, cry, you know, <laughs> all of it, please. Hello, I'm Tom. And I'm Richard. We're from the band Keen. We're here at Starlight Oxton. It's an amazing setting and we can't wait to get out on stage and play. <laughs>